Welcome all my beautiful signs and souls of the Zodiac. I'm Brenda, Brenda Tarot, and I'm here again today to bring you your Angel Tarot and Oracle card reading. I truly want to thank you for your interest in my channel and for viewing, liking, sharing, and of course, subscribing. Please be sure when you do subscribe to pick that option, A-L-L, and you'll get notified immediately when any of my card readings are out here for you to view or when I go live to give out free messages in the chat line. So this is, as you know, a general reading, and that means that not every single card will resonate with every single one of you or the energy they carry. So take what you can from it and throw the rest out into the universe. If you want clarity, accuracy, and answers to any questions, then I welcome you to click the little icon in the top right hand corner of this video and it will take you directly to my website where you can see the services that I offer. But you know something? All that information is posted below this video in the description box. So there you go. All right, my beautiful, beautiful souls, let's get on with your reading. Welcome Libra. This is your angel and tarot card reading for the week of August the 24th to the 31st, 2020. Taking a quick look at the cards that are here. Um, <clears throat> this is a really interesting read. You know that I don't do on a regular basis uh, romance or uh, relationship readings out here on YouTube. I only do them privately. Um, I haven't had great response when I do. So um, this reading particularly leads me to believe that some of you are really looking for the abundance in the emotional part and relationship part of your life. Whether it's with you know someone who you want to have a, a romantic relationship with or a platonic relationship. You've got three amazing pages here. The Page of Wands, the Page of Pentacles, and the Page of Cups here. So I do see that you're going to have an offer coming in here with the Page of Pentacles, the first page, that's a window of opportunity that's going to lead you towards the goal and, and inspire you to go towards something that you truly want, whether it's in the form of a relationship or whether it's in the form of an opportunity opening a door for your career this week. Three beautiful reasons to be enthusiastic, feel, feel light at heart and want to be exuberant going towards you want with this youthful, youthful energy that you're going to just seem to invent this week. Now, <clears throat> excuse me, your crowning energy here is the beautiful Two of Cups. And again, you know, the Two of Cups is all about relationship connections or perhaps partnerships, getting together with someone of like minds, okay, moving towards someone. And it could be in a romantic way or it could be it could be reconciliation and forgiveness from a, a situation that you have felt you had a loss here from with the Five of Pentacles, but it will be reconciliation or forgiveness. I mean, the Two of Cups means marriage of of sorts with an individual or marriage of minds getting together the duality of joining together okay joining forces right now you know you got the page of pentacles and the page of pentacles is all about moving towards your goals going towards what you want in the financial sector of your life okay you may be getting this beautiful beautiful opportunity this window of opportunity opening up and you need to step up and take it okay step up and do that because you have this ability to set the wheels in motion to go towards your goals here with some new opportunity opening up to you whether it's an opportunity for your work sector of your life or your relationship sector of your life and then look who shows up the page of cups now that's that is a definite somebody coming into you with their hand in appreciation love affection respect gratification something like that and this is about you being able to also trust your own intuition okay um, it could be the beginning of a, a young and new budding relationship okay but again it talks about finding it in your heart to forgive some situation so you may be forgiving here feeling a loss feel forgiving someone for something that you may have lost in the past 
whether it's the ending of a situation or the ending of a relationship. But I'm seeing that things are improving here because you're coming in here with your make a wish and then you're getting fulfillment, wishes fulfilled. So this is a great reading. I think a lot of it has to do with a relationship that you're going to be having with somebody, you are having with somebody, or a new budding relationship coming into you. And this energy could be youthful and young and, and you know, uh, exciting. Uh, maybe they are younger, look younger, act younger, but they're going to bring this element of excitement into your week. Okay, so let's start off, as I said, and see what we're going to do here with our clarification cards uh, this week. Coming in with your Two of Cups, you have the Two of Cups wands and perhaps you have been wishing and hoping for something to come into you and now you're holding the world in your hands and you're moving forward to, uh, it towards that uh, beautiful goal that you want this is a beautiful card of inspiration this is saying that you know you're starting on a new journey here perhaps it's with a partner perhaps it's with a new love a new friendship or a new idea that is inspiring you to feel this great love within you okay know that uh, you need to be aware of your intentions this is you carrying the not your you know the gift of and the power of your knowledge within you to move forward you're looking for a new adventure you're ready for it you're ready for something new and exciting in your life this week so follow up on it okay have an open mind when you do this as well Wow, this is an interesting week for you, Libra. Again, you've got the Page of Pentacles, and I said that. You know, be free. Be free, be free to open up what it is you want and invite it in, okay? Because you've got this window of opportunity coming into you, and it may be something different. Maybe you, you know, you thought you might look, you might not want to take this road. You might not want to go towards this. Maybe it's an unusual job uh, offer that's coming in, and you're thinking, well, I've never done that before. Uh, I don't know if I can. Yes get excited or for others you may have thought about this in the back of your mind for a long time and this is saying jump in go for it okay you have to go over uh, you have to go after what it is you want okay let's you have to let go and get on with it right so this is a wonderful new opportunity coming into some of you whether it's in the opportunity of a partnership getting into business with somebody or getting together with someone who has the same thought pattern and the same goals and um inspirational thoughts that you do their goals are the same and you're getting an offer here to go towards it so step up because I'm seeing that you're going to be able to see things changing if you continue to be open-minded you thought you were stuck in a situation and you couldn't make a choice or a decision because you couldn't see your, the picture clearly so remove the blinders do not hold yourself back here when this offer and opportunity shows up don't be timid step up into your boldness because you're only going to find out that you can get ahead when you're enthusiastic stay focused on it see the whole picture remove those blindfolders you're not stuck in a situation there's absolutely nothing there impeding her 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 position that she cannot move forward see she's conjured this up in her mind she's she's made herself lose her lack of confidence by thinking she can't do it this here this is what you have to do jump into it with exuberance and excitement don't be afraid of change coming in because I'm telling you Libras you're gonna have reason here to celebrate okay and be grateful and give thanks because this is telling me here that you will make this decision and if you do make this decision you're going to be able to get recognized you're going to be able to uh, be seen by others you're going to be able to celebrate this is usually after struggle you might have you might have had some struggle here okay but it's victory it's victory and reward okay and getting noticed being the center of attraction when you step up and do this okay so be proud of what you're doing right now this is all about stepping up and getting noticed moving on to the next phase the next project the next beautiful stage here in your life something's ended exactly and this is why you had to move forward something ended my beautiful Libras whether it was a situation in a relationship or it was a situation in your job something ended okay and it's okay because the death card means we move on we open the door to possibility we move on to the new next adventure and this card always says embrace it embrace the change that this ending brought 
Okay, I love the death card. Like I told you, it's not a bad card. It's about something ended and we now have the opportunity to move forward. You know, so many things ended in these last four months for so many people. And that meant they had to go in a new direction. But you're getting the offer here of opportunities to open the door and move forward. So do it, Libra. Don't be afraid. Don't get stuck up in your head and think, oh, well, I can't do it. I'm afraid. It's no. Keep your eyes open to all possibilities here because bingo, here comes the Knight of Wands. He steps up and the Knight of Wands is all about, uh, you know, being adventurous, charging in, uh, you know, <clears throat> taking on new adventures. This is also someone who could be coming into your life. They're charming. They come charging in. Uh, you know, all of a sudden there they are and they kind of uh, sweep you off your feet. Okay, keep your eyes open for that, but be open to possibilities as well. If it is someone coming into you that's, that is charging in towards you, they're so excited to meet you. And it could be an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarian that's coming in uh, that wants to meet you uh, and to, to share this with. But this is about, you know, stepping up, beating your, beating your own drum, being individual, being authentic, and stepping up into, uh, into your new world as I say your new adventure here you know try not to be too impulsive I'm telling you to get excited here but try not to be in too impulsive make sure you know what it is you're going into okay because you can make great accomplishments here <clears throat> six of coins the gifts are coming in Okay, six of pentacles. You're going to see that you're going to be going through certain stages now of give and take. You know, maybe you're in the process of discussing things with somebody and you've had to bring compromise into the equation here. Uh, and you, and, But you're going to receive the gifts of fairness coming in here. Okay, it could be <clears throat> generosity coming in. It could be consideration. It could be compromise coming in. But it's about loss and gain right because right after that you're going to see the losses that you had thought about but on top of this beautiful card here you're you're going to see things coming into you okay you're going to see the gift coming in all right this is going to be a wonderful thing some of you might be helping people out some of you might be getting help from other people so this is a card that says you know uh, you're going to be able to get fair and just gifts okay time support effort right or money stay focused all right stand in your integrity here because as I said you have had these problems okay um, you know you still might be concerned and thinking back let the past go okay because this is a brand new beginning for you we can't continually uh, can't continually think about this moment and then expect things are going to improve right this is your celebration after victory okay great victory rather after <laughs> struggle I mean so don't worry anymore my beautiful friends because you're going to get all this help perhaps these three pentacle these three pages that are coming in here can't get my tongue to work this morning it's like seven in the morning be patient please uh this means that you need to put this behind you okay put the past behind you let it go what's done is done okay and now by receiving the the exciting advice and opportunities and energy coming into you these three pages are coming in with with messages for you this week that you can move forward in the bright new direction you want to go and be able to see your future ahead of you with promise with vision with happiness and you know again here is your here's another page the pa as I said the page of Pentacles and this page brings in a wonderful opportunity here okay a beautiful opportunity to step up and this window of opportunity opens up open it and go through it don't be afraid okay because he this his page brings in this wonderful opportunity to set the wheels in motion for you to go towards your go towards what you want and often this page is referred to as the messenger the financial messenger that comes in okay so it represents a you know it could represent somebody that you know around you again it could be a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn that's coming in with this exciting offer for you right okay so be a team player step up and go after this okay because it could be a career it could be some sort of an enterprise um, but it's or it could be something coming in to bring clarity to a relationship but it's the get on and get the job done card beautiful you know you're 
throughout all of this, you're going to demonstrate patience. You're going to demonstrate compassion. You're going to demonstrate kindness and compromise into the equation. Sometimes it's forgiveness too. But when this strength comes up, strength card comes up, it knows that it's, it, it advises you that when you're communicating with others, whether it's in a relationship or whether it's in someone to do with your job, your career, that you're going to do it with a little more understanding because you can catch a whole lot more bees with honey, as I tell you, than you can with vinegar. So you're going to be looking at this situation here and you're going to count your blessings. Oh my gosh, to get this window of opportunity coming in that could possibly be a message of good news to do with finances. Then you come in here with the page of cups. This page of cups could be somebody coming in to offer you attention, affection, uh, you know, um, appreciation or love or forgiveness all right this page of cups comes in with an offer and he's young and he's youthful he brings that exuberance in he could also be somebody you thought you would never ever be attracted to in a relationship uh, of any kind but give it a chance because this is a wonderful distraction something that's going to bring in the compassion that you need to look at this week this is a beautiful, beautiful offer. I always tell people he, he may not be a life mate, but he's going to be uh, he's going to be a playmate, and you're going to have fun with this page of cups, okay? Because he's often depicted with holding a cup in traditional tarot with a fish in it, right? I mean, is that a real true gift? I mean, who brings you a beautiful vessel with a fish in it, right? So uh, trust your own intuition, because this could be a young, imaginative lover coming in. All right, but it could be somebody coming in that wants to ask you forgiveness for something. Maybe there's a youth around you, a young person coming in saying, you know, I'm really sorry I did this. I was impulsive. I didn't think I was being immature. It could also be a situation like that. But justice is going to be served. Things are going to work out in your favor. You're going to take control of a situation. You're going to stand up for your own integrity, your own rights, and justice is going to be served. So if any of you are dealing with a situation like this, know that it's going, you're going to win. It's a win-win situation for you. If you're dealing with a situation in court, know that the rulings will be made in your favor because you stood you stood up to yourself because you, you put down the law and you said, look, this is the truth, the whole truth, nothing but the truth, and I'm not backing down from it. Okay, so you could you could be dealing with this young, uh, this young impetuous, uh, you know, uh, youth, uh, youthful energy around you, and you're going to be able to uh, make things work out. You're going to be there. Maybe you're going to be there communicating. They're telling me with this person, and you're going to put the hammer down, and uh, you know you're going to make your point made, and it's going to you know you're going to bring clarification into it. This is your wishes fulfilled make your dream card okay so make a wish right know that when you get the nine of cups oh my gosh it's like fulfillment coming into you absolutely fulfillment coming into you so uh you know wishes fulfilled right you're going to be able to enjoy things in your life again and you're going to be counting your blessings because of it and there you go bingo i mean don't you just love how my guides give the perfect cards for clarification the best card in the whole deck, Libra, the sun. Being able to see your path illuminated now. Being able to know that you're going to be able to deal with any challenges this week. You're going to be open-minded. You're going to have opportunities coming in to step up and do what it is you need to do to bring this fulfillment into your life. This is a beautiful card of you being able to see light at the end of the tunnel now. The sun illuminating your path to let you see where it is you need to go absolutely absolutely beautiful card also you're attracting that kind of energy towards you in people so you're going to be attracting someone to you of like minds that's going to help you and want to walk this path with you of fulfillment as well beautiful because look what you got you made your wish and now you've got the wish fulfilled completely okay ten ten of cups yes it's come in your, your beautiful abundance has arrived, okay? You're happy now. You're going to be happy in your home life, your family life. You're going to have peace and harmony now. And you feel safe within this, this energy around you now. This is 
beautiful beautiful card uh, you know um, it's all about positivity it's all about you know you've worked hard for the peace and, and commitment in your life and now you're going to see it you stepped up and you made things happen you made your wish you stepped up you did what you had to do in the communication part of it and now you got the happy ever after card so beautiful way to end this reading oh poof, look on top of the ten of cups you get the ten of pentacles yes this is an amazing positive read coming in below the sun you get the you know and below the nine of cups you get the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles it doesn't get much better than that my gosh look what you've got here you've got this most amazing read here this week you've applied the work you've moved on from a situation and now you're going to see fulfillment this is like mind-blowing right this is all about the good life now coming into you and enjoying everything that you deserve. Again, it's about, you know, a successful and a prosperous time coming into you. Embrace it. Let the past go here, my beautiful Libras, okay? Move on. Uh, you're going to see prosperity coming in. I forgot to put something uh, to clarify the Five of Pentacles. Let's see what they've got. The Queen of Pentacles. Absolutely. Isn't it, isn't it amazing how all these, these cards have come up? And it would have been the strength card that landed on that had I picked it up. But you got the queen, the queen of pentacles. She is the nurturing. She is the mother figure. She has that ability to nurture herself and heal herself through situations of loss. And by doing so, she's able to transcend that energy out into the universe to everybody else around her. Okay? Doing what you know is right for you stepping up into your integrity here with the justice right beside you perfect perfect card i thank you spirit for pointing out that error on you know that that error but you brought me the perfect message that libra needed to hear ah thank you thank you spirit now let's see what our theme card is i mean this week is amazing well of course you got new love we talked about the two of two of cups you've got new love coming in and it could be in the form of any one of these pentac any one of these pages here okay the wands the cups and the pentacles you could have this youthful exuberant love coming into you that makes you feel young and 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 so so happy this is absolutely the be a beautiful card of new love coming into you okay a new chapter in your love life is going to begin or the love of a situation right so know that the divine is preparing you to be aware of new people entering your life as a new mate maybe unlike any of your previous partners so be open to it that's what i said to you about the the, the page of cups they might you know he may come in or she may come in and they may not be what you had thought you were going to ever be attracted to because you're going to say well they're too young they're too this they're too that what are people going to say forget about what people are going to say this is your life this is your journey not theirs okay so be open to changes in your current relationships and don't cling tightly to the ideas of how you think relationships should be there's going to be change in your love life my friends okay and you know what changes in your love life will only be painful if you're rigid in your thoughts or behaviors so loosen up go with the flow here okay it's going to bring you aspiring happiness it will trust me okay outcome card stay focused absolutely this is from the ascended masters and this is usually about being assertive with demands upon your time okay step up but stay balanced and keep yourself centered keep your promises to yourself all right do what it is that makes your heart sing do what it is that you want to do step up into this beautiful beautiful exciting uh you know exciting new offers that are coming into you this week commit to your priorities make out that list what's most important to you libra make out that list and check it off this is your journey you deserve to do that devote yourself to the projects that are dear to your heart whether it's being with somebody in a, and communicating in a relationship or whether it's doing what it is you love it could be an it could be an activity that you love right but also this is about detoxifying your diet to help your mind be clear and focused so stand in your integrity stand in your ability to do what's right for you 
that's going to bring you complete clarity, sobriety to be able to step up and focus. You need to stay focused. Okay, we can't be focused if we're not doing things that are healthy for ourselves. You want to get rid of anything that's slowing you down, stopping you from moving forward in a prosperous and positive direction on your path. You want to expand and grow. Something's coming in here because it's the perfect time. All right, answers from the angels deck. All right, it's the perfect time for this situation to unfold here in your life. Move forward. Go towards it with confidence. Don't be afraid to step up and take on these new opportunities. As I said, this new love or this new job, this new, this new event, this new passion. Don't hesitate. Go on through that energy gateway because it's opening up for you right now. It's the perfect time for you to make these changes and moves towards what you want to do. Beautiful. Your final outcome card is the labyrinth. Don't hold yourself back. Maybe you're, you know, things have taken a long time for you to be able to see your fulfillment come in here, but it's coming in here. Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Cups, Nine of Cups, the Sun, Victory, absolutely. And all because you stood in your integrity and your strength and stay determined, stay focused. You're on the right path path and you're going to see this come to fruition if you don't waver or give up okay so stay focused my beautiful Libras keep going towards your goals you're going to see opportunity present itself as long as you go towards it with confidence you're going to see it happen it's going to be a fun week for some of you. You're going to meet somebody new, somebody that you wouldn't expect that you would want to even be involved with or attracted to, and they're going to bring in this beautiful fun for you. But there's opportunities and doors opening. You know, things, something ended in the past that left you feeling a loss, but you nurtured and healed yourself through it to see success coming in. Beautiful, beautiful reading. Oh my gosh, Libras, I am blown away. I wish you a great remainder to today and a beautiful optimistic week here to look forward to. And always tell yourself not to forget how far you've come, everything you've gotten through, all the times you have pushed on even when you felt you couldn't, right? All the mornings you got out of bed, no matter how hard it was, and even the times when you, you, you know, you wanted to give up, but because you didn't, right, you got through another day. Always remember how much strength you have learned and developed throughout all of the challenges that have led you to here today. I keep telling you the universe and the divine, your higher power, want you to succeed and find your happiness and peace. So please, my beautiful soul, surrender to it and move forward towards these beautiful goals and this week, your goals and happiness. And remember, I always say blessings, my beautiful souls, and know that I always and only stand in this circle of love and light for you. Again, my prayers and blessings are that you stay in continued good health, spiritually, mentally, and physically. Please play safe, be safe, and stay safe, and I'll see you soon.